Hi guys, Jeff again at Cutter Masters. We're running a variable flute end mill. And we're all set up because we've been doing these 30 thou reds. So now we're just loading another tool. So essentially we have the rear indexing collar set up to govern our length. We've just finished a grind. So we've loaded a tool, that means we don't know what the length is. We have the attitude that we want on the tool rest. So now we're gonna just move the upper axis away a little bit. And then we can swing the 90 just to see if we have the right end clearance, just to make sure you're not gonna crash the tool. Now basically, once you're at this point, you can feed into the wheel, work pretty close to it, and start your grind. And then you're all set. Very easy to do. All the teeth will be the same because they're all sitting on the same rest when they swing on the rest. Pretty much it.